is up my ASMR and fragrance family. It is your boy, your whispering perfume pimp, Christopher Cologne, and I am back with another Cologne video. So I really got to start looking at that, at that camera, because leaning up like this right here and then looking off that way, that way, just because I'm looking at the screen. Instead of looking at the camera, I really gotta, really, really gotta look at the camera. Or Samsung or somebody, y'all could come out to where you put a camera on the side right here. The side right there, you know, right there. The hell's on my finger. Loose piece of skin. Okay, but yeah. Y'all could come out to where you put a camera right there. Right there. Then that way, us creators, whenever we're doing this, we're still looking right at the camera when we're looking at the screen, instead of having to look over to the side to look at the camera. Get what I'm saying? So, come on, Samsung, Motorola, somebody, don't make it a hot. Come on, Apple, don't you be the first to do it because I don't like Apple products. I've had a couple of them and I find them highly, highly overrated. So, spent a bunch of money on a MacBook one time because Mac is supposed to be the greatest thing to record music with. The damn thing wouldn't even hold, wouldn't, wasn't, it didn't even have enough of memory or anything like that to where it could support Pro Tools, my recording program that I had. So, there went that. That was a total piss-ass waste of money. Um, and then, I've had an iPhone, too. It's just, they're not that big of a deal. Damn, I'd rather, I'd rather have an Android phone. And I'd rather just have a regular old PC, you know. With a regular old PC operating program, Microsoft or whatever. So, even though Microsoft has its problems... But, yeah, so, but anyway, this ain't about computers or anything like that. This is my five, my five, five, five favorite cool weather fragrances. So, now I have more than these that I really like just as much as I do these, but these are just like the five that I'm rocking with for this video. So, um, which if y'all have a bunch of different fragrances or you know, or have smelled a bunch of different fragrances. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Plus, these are the five full bottles. That's what it is, five full bottles. So, because there is ones that I like just as much, if not more, that I wanted to grab. But, uh, I just couldn't, like, like this right here, Invictus Victory Elixir, which is what Mike sent me. I really like this. This is great, but uh, I don't have the full bottle, so, but yeah. So we're gonna start off with Azaro, 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 hot pepper, Azaro, hot pepper. Got a sweetness to it, it's definitely a spiciness, because it's got pink pepper, cayenne pepper, and something else. I can't remember, but we're going, that's why, that's why we're going to look it up. Okay, now this, you can get this for like the the 30 to $50 range, somewhere around there. Or I mean the 30 to $45 range. But yeah, so it's chili pepper, pink pepper, and cashmere. Did I say something? What did I say before? I don't remember. Uh, but yeah. Chili pepper, pink pepper, and cashmere, and it was released in 2018, which is uh, for some reason I was thinking it was 2020, but evidently not. But yeah, so this is great. One of my favorites, as you can tell. Look at how much I think I gave away a 10 milliliter bottle of this, but other than that 10 milliliter, that's how much I have worn of this, and I've had this for two years now. This has been my most worn, probably for probably my most worn fragrance, and if not the most worn, one of my top like top three. So spray for y'all, spray for me. Oh man, I love 
this stuff. I love this stuff. I'm gonna find some, and this layer is good with a couple different things, which I gotta get y'all a layering video. But yeah, so this is Zorro hot pepper. Okay, now what we're gonna do, we're gonna come in, which this is probably gonna smell good, coming in behind it. Uh, we got B. Layered's Geneva chocolate. Now, this is the one that I got from Mike. Appreciate you, Mike. Uh, it, uh, I really appreciate it because it's a full damn bottle. Uh, but yeah, and this is an EDP. The, this smells like a straight up hot chocolate. So just straight up high grade hot chocolate. That's what it smells like to me. So I want to see what it smells like coming behind that Azaro hot pepper. So spray for y'all, spray for me. Yo, I think that's going to rock great together. That does. It doesn't add as much spiciness to it as I thought. I guess it's the Cash Moran. I don't know. Or the pink pepper. Because I think pink pepper itself has a sweetness to it. So that could be why the sweetness in this is not is not standing out with the chocolate as much as I thought it would. It's more so blending better, but they smell good together. So yeah, uh, and the only note to this is chocolate, so if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, a sorrow hot pepper and B. Laird's Geneva chocolate. Okay, now, uh, now what I have next is, and the good thing is, like, these are all $50 or less for, well, not the last two, but now we have Rayan Traditions, Rayan Traditions Insurrection, this is the original Insurrection. Um, this is real vanilla and real powdery, so spray for y'all, spray for me. That smells really good coming in behind those. Damn. That smells really good coming in behind those. A triple layer. This is a good triple layer right here. Good triple layer. So, uh, yeah, we're going to look up the notes to this right quick. Give y'all a little bit of tapping. I'm in surprisingly, uh, I'm in a surprisingly good mood considering my truck is sitting at a friend's house, broke down. And I'm about to have to cash in my 401k to have it fixed. So, well, cash in at least some of it. Hopefully not all of it because I don't have a lot in my 401k. So, because I didn't get into the whole 401k thing until the past couple of years. But, yeah, so. Um, so, we're going to pause this. Okay, and a good thing about this is, I don't remember if I said it, sub $20. So, $20 range, $20.99, below $20, you know, somewhere around there. But the notes, the notes are vanilla, amber, aromatic spices, and woody notes. So, and like I said, what, you mainly, what I mainly get out of this is a powdery vanilla. I mean, it has that... It's not like a feminine powdery vanilla. Like I know a lot of people when they hear powder, they think of, they think more of like a feminine fragrance, but it's really not. So, okay, now what we have, last two, last two, okay. Now we have one of my favorites, Fireside Bourbon by Dr. Squatch. Has a fruity vanilla smell to me, but I've been smelling like the spiciness to it and everything because it's got uh, it's geranium, uh, cedarwood, Virginia, and something else. I can't remember what the other note is. But let's go ahead and cleanse that palate. I'll look up the notes because I can't remember. It's three notes and I cannot remember the third one. Okay, now this is supposedly an all-natural fragrance, so 
Uh, now I do spray this on my skin. Oh, and it has patchouli in it. So, uh, this is $59. So, for 1.7 ounce. That's the only thing I don't like about it is the price range. The price tag, but... Yeah, it's got a fruitiness to it. It has like a vanilla. So, spray for y'all. Spray for me. I suppose. Like it has a leatheriness to it. A leather to it. But yeah, it, it smells really good. And this, I say, even though I say this is winter time, I honestly think this is more of like this can be year round so it can be year round yeah and it has like a woodsiness to it too so which has probably the, the cedar wood so uh, and then mixed with the patchouli um, I'm not sure what geranium smells like because I've never smelled geranium by itself before you know so I really, really got to figure out a way to drop this damn weight that I blew the hell up and ended up gaining. So, okay. Now, last one is Dolce & Gabbana, the one EDP. Dolce & Gabbana, the one EDP. That wind is still blowing like crazy. <laughs> I said I was going to do last video. I got done with that one. I started uploading it. Did my you did my thumbnail and everything and then started making this one. I still got to do my part two for my fragrances. I'm going to wear more in 2024. Oh, I didn't even give y'all a sniff, did I? this and look up the notes okay so now I'm on the site for I'm on the Dolce and Gabbana site so it has uh, has Australian sandalwood Italian Tarocco orange French clary sage and Australian sandalwood if I didn't already say that I think I did but yeah so you got some herbaceousness you got fruitiness and all that so so spray for y'all spray for me yeah yeah that's just it's a good date night fragrance uh I'm trying to think how much it is like what the price range is but yeah you got your fruitiness you got your somewhat creaminess um i suppose i suppose i do smell a little bit of herbaceous never i don't think i've ever thought about it but yeah i want to smell the edt so but this it looks like this goes for well, on Joma Shop, on Joma Shop, you can get you can get a 3.4 ounce tester, which I think this is what this is. You can get a 58.19 from Joma Shop. So, and Joma Shop, yeah, I think you can get like $20 off when you first sign up or whatever. So, but yeah, I'd like to smell the whole the one line. So, uh, yeah. Okay, y'all. So. See, now this is what. Now. Now, according to Frank Granica, the notes are grapefruit, coriander, and basil. And the top and then the middle notes are cardamom, ginger, and orange blossom. And then the base notes are amber, tobacco, and cedar. That's funny because I don't think any of those were on the Dolce & Gabbana website. So, 
but yeah, that's just according to them. But yeah, that's according to Frey Granica. Wait, you hold on. I'm gonna see if there's more notes on the site. Okay, yeah, I didn't see any more notes on the site, so. But yeah. So I gave you all the notes that Frey Granica has, and I gave you all the notes that uh, the actual site has. So. But yeah, it's just it's your your more darker fragrance that's all it sucks because i was looking at the ingredients and the it has bhd in it so y'all know i want to stay away from bhd but yeah i've noticed the more i spray this stuff the more i spray it it's kind of like the worse i get with my head feeling the dizzy feeling and all that shit it's not like immediate it's like a just a you know that's a word i'm looking for um uh, residual i guess i guess that's the word i'm looking for the residual effects of it it's just kind of like you know you can be around something and you really don't feel its effects until later so it's like that's it's like that's what it is the more and more i spray all this stuff and i have to do with it it's like the worse i get but you know whenever i quit i notice i feel better but i also notice it's other things too because i'm trying to figure out if i have a gluten intolerance still and all that because i've noticed too certain foods the more i eat certain foods the worse i get too so who knows you know when you look at everything around the world especially america we have so many chemicals and so much shit you know that's like you could have and then on top of it all you like you could have mold in your house and not know it and mold can affect you and it just depends on how susceptible you are to do the mold really you know some people it's just it's a it's just like any other allergy you know some people can be around cats some people get around cats and their allergies go all this you know it, it sets off a whole world of things some people can just be somewhat allergic to stuff and they can be around it as long as they don't fuck with it too much you know so i don't know it's just, it's a whole process. I'm trying to figure out what all the hell is going on with me and everything, you know, considering I do have the Kiari and all that shit. So stuff I've talked to y'all about plenty of times. But I'm going to get off here, y'all. And uh, I'm going to get off here and I'm going to get this mess of clones all cleaned up and everything. And I will see y'all next video. Y'all take it easy. And peace, 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 peace.